Hi, welcome. Um, this is now the second part. Um, the first part you can see uh, in the video just before this one. Uh, I'm now doing a little bit of color to the, the uh, fishes so they pop out a little bit more. Uh, actually, you can use the um, cover up stencil if you don't want the color on the outside. But um, for me, this is like, accurate enough. So um, I've done the whole fish in orange, and now I'm using the the full white stencil to do some highlights again. So as you can see, um, in the stencil set you get the three-part uh, background for the reef and a uh, single uh, fishes. So you get the swarm with uh, five fishes and the same fish type, but just a little bit bigger. And uh, the water structure and some stars. So that's for the background and now, uh, uh, now comes the shark. It's a five-part uh, stencil set, and also there are some shark silhouettes for the background if you want to use them. Uh, highly detailed. So I'm using the first stencil, and um, I'm doing white because uh, the shark afterwards is like grey-white and uh, blue-grey. You don't need to, to do it in the full white, so just that it's um, lighter than the background. Um, now I'm using the opaque black for stencils number 2, 3 and 4. Um, first stencil is uh, most important because every follow-up stencil uh, depends on this one. So uh, here you get all the outside details to put the follow-up stencils in the correct position. So for example, if you to, uh, choose the tip of the nose and the fins, you look for two or three um, points in a different direction, and if they fit, the whole stencil fits perfectly. So now I'm using um, the third stencil with a darker grey and uh, this is stencil number four and they can also see the silhouettes that's, that are in this set. I'm not using it but you can buy the set and then they're in this set. So I've used the grey and now I'm, I'm using the uh, light blue to paint over it, so you get like a grey blue. And I still need to get the, the white belly. Um, this now is the fifth stencil and also the white. But I'm not using the full white, but mostly like 50% of white so that you get highlights but not um, that they pop out too much too much so as um, the final stencil is now the cover-up stencil and um, the final details in the teeth and the eye are in this stencil. So, as you can see, if it fits to the outside, the, the inside uh, stencils are fitting perfectly. So you get the, the highlights where they belong.
so on to um, finally using the the transplant colors again to uh, get rid of every overspray in the background. Uh, the beauty of the stencil is you can always like put the stencils back in and do some some detail work again. So um, like you can paint see if something uh, is missing you can add it again okay that's the shark hope you liked it and um, see you soon